Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Brothers and sisters, there are so many benefits of waking up early in the morning. I'm not going to go over all of the benefits, but I've chosen four benefits for us to comprehend and understand the importance of waking up. Number one, if a person wakes up early in the morning, they have that ability not to have the feeling of being rushed. Have you ever woken up in the morning and it's eight o'clock and all of a sudden you don't know why you're stressed out, but you're stressed out and everything you do, you do it with stress. You uh, eat your breakfast in the morning with stress. You speak with your family, relatives and family with stress. You're on the road in a hazard traffic and you're stressed out. You go to work and you're even more stressed out and the day goes down from there. Why? It's because we are not part of those who we can define as the early birds. So number one, when we wake up early, we have the ability of not having the feeling of being rushed. Number two, it helps us achieve a good night's sleep. Every single human being needs a good night's sleep. When a person wakes up early in the morning, because they've been up from very early, very energetic, very useful, very proactive, very productive, one finds themselves throughout the day starting to feel tired. And when night comes, it allows them to have a beautiful, constructive, important sleep. So number two, when we wake up early, we're able to sleep better. Number three, we better perform and our grades are much better. Have you ever seen that some of the most successful people in life, you will see that there's one common habit that they all have, and that is they all wake up early. They all wake up early. The best ideas that you'll find in your life will be early in the morning. So all of those things can be achieved in the morning. Number four, they call it the lone wolf, self-time. Every single person, doesn't matter who we are, everybody needs time for themselves. Sometimes we want to get, get rid of bad habits. Sometimes we want to inculcate habits in our life. All of these things can be achieved if we take out time for ourselves. There's a saying, if you don't have 10 minutes for yourself, you don't have a life. In the morning is the best time. Why? Because everyone is asleep. There's no television. There's no phone calls happening because everyone, the wider community is asleep. But you are awake by yourself. It is a time for reflection. It is a time for contemplation. It is a time if you want to get into exercise, if you want to get into a diet, all of these things can be achieved by waking up early. So these are four things. Now, I want to add, I want to give you a gift today. Something to put the cherry on the cake. What we've spoken about so far is the, uh, what they call the psychology behind it and the physiology behind it. And we can see the beauty already. But can I tell you what is the biggest gift that is achieved when a person wakes up in the morning? Spirituality. When a person wakes up in the morning and they pray Fajr Salah and they make wudu, for ahsan and wudu, and they perfect their wudu, and then they raise up their hands and they say Allahu Akbar and they stand and they connect with their creator and they ask from their creator which allows them to, uh, to, to think positively, to allow them to understand the purpose of life. How beautiful will that day be with the blessings of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? So Allah has already foreseen the importance and made compulsory upon us five daily prayers. And from that five daily prayers is before sunrise. Us Muslims, we're awake. Why? Because we are praying Fajr Salah. Let us understand the importance of waking up early. We are going to achieve philosophy. We're going to achieve psychology, physiology, and most importantly, spirituality. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.